he started showing me his. But y'all, when I tell y'all he's tall, y'all like you like it's like he's like what the fuck type of tall. We went to get into it. Start. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and it's your favorite type of video because today we're doing a uh, story time. So I kind of touched on this story before, but I ain't get too in depth into it. I think because I said hey, I, think I had a boyfriend. Right now, no. we're gonna talk about um, you know, the time. I was in a little like situation with the like star player of the team. So before we get into this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you're new to my channel. Subscribe because you're gonna love it here. If you're not new to my channel, thank you for supporting me. Um, I think it's about to be like my second year on YouTube. It's about to make a second two years. I don't know, something like that. But it don't matter. Make sure you guys follow all my social medias to stay in touch. And let's just get in. Alright, so this was in college. So if y'all don't know, long story short, I got kicked out of college. Uh basically cause I came out and the boys like in the dorm that I lived in, like I guess they didn't like it. So it was like a little animosity for some weeks and then it was like, you know, more of the like you know, everybody was just staring at each other, people didn't like each other, certain groups couldn't speak to certain groups. It was just a lot of that. And it led to me and one of the people fighting and they just like kinda like, you know, dick rod. Anyway, so, I'm going to tell y'all how I met this boy, and I'm gonna we're not going to really say his name, of course. We're going to call him, we're going to call him Spirit. So, Spirit, I mean, I don't care if he sees this and he knows about him, because, like, I don't know. I don't care if the team members see it and they know it's about him. I'm just not saying his name for, you know, just my reasons. Anyway, Spirit was the tallest nigga on the team. Spirit was... Like, he had to duck to get in the room. Like, that was a long... That nigga, he was long. Like, spirit was... Spirit was tall. So, um, I met him. One day, all of us went to, like, a college party. And we was only at the party for about an hour. And then the cops came. And, you know, college parties get shut down because there's a lot of alcohol. And depending on what type of college you go to, it's, it's a bunch of other stuff. Y'all know, know what, the, y know what the, the parties is giving. So, the party got shut down. And everybody ended up having to run through the back of the house. So it's like, the party was like in the middle of the house. The cops came through the front. Everybody had to run through the back and jump over like fences and gates and all, all, all types of shit. If you had me on Snap, like since I started this, then I know you saw it because I posted the whole night. Because like, I was recording as we was running. Like, it was crazy. Um, we all happened to be at the party. My, me and my friend group, him, his friend group, we just, you know, all happened to be at the party. So the party got shut down, we ended up going, everybody went back to my dorm, because we all was, you know, gonna just chill, hang out, because the night got cut short, nobody had no class tomorrow, nobody had no school tomorrow, shit like that. Um, so, we all go to my dorm. We get to my dorm, everybody chilling, talking, we like taking little sips. In college, we drunk like Four Locos, because there wasn't no liquor store over there, so we all drunk Four Locos, and teleport, like... Bro, that was so ghetto, but that's that's what we drunk. So, we was drinking that, sipping that, we were talking, chilling, boom. First flag. He started showing me his videos, like, you know, his his nasty videos with girls. It, nah, what? It didn't really catch me because I was straight at the time. I had a girlfriend as well. He knew my girlfriend because she went to the school. So he showed me his videos with girls or whatever, but yeah, like I knew what I was, so you know what I'm looking at. I'm like, okay, like, you know. So he just kept going, kept going, kept going, kept going, kept going. So we was we just was just it was it, in the in the beginning it was just simply that. After that he he was like, What's your snap? You mad cool. So I'm like, oh, uh, okay, so I gave him my snap. I'm not thinking of it, and I'm not girly with it, because this before I was, you know, in touch with my feminine side. It's before I knew I was, like, you know, like, no, I'm lying, I'm lying. I knew what I was this before I accepted it. This is when I was trying to, like, you know, have girls to, like, you know, cover it up or whatever. So, um, he asked for my snap. I gave him my snap. But we didn't, he didn't text me on snap. Like, we weren't texting, wasn't speaking on snap, nothing. So, about two days later, he was like, yo, what's the, like, what's, like, what they say? He say, wherever he from, they say, what niggas on? New York, we say, what's the word? 
You know what I'm saying? Like, like what, what we doing tonight? What's, what's, where is that? What's the word? He said, what niggas on? So, I'm like, uh, nothing. Like, there's no parties or nothing. So, we just chilling. He was like, oh, I'm about to come to your dorm. Mind you, we it was in the same building. My dorm was like on this side. And his dorm was like a little bit more down the, the hallway or whatever. So... He came to the dorm, whatever, everybody chilling. Again, me, him, my roommate, my other friend, my two other friends. We just all chilling, just, just just talking. Like, we just, like, I'm laying one way on the bed, other nigga sitting in the chair, other nigga laying on his bed, other nigga sitting on another chair, two niggas standing up. Like, we just was, we just was chilling. Um, the whole, it went, like, to the whole entire night. Hold on, I need some juice, y'all. He, everybody, this, it got late, like, it got late at night or whatever, so everybody had left, you know, departed rooms, everybody going back to their room, or whatever, they going to get to eat in their room, whatever, whatever. I didn't really like the school, I remember this night so perfect, because it was shocking to me, this before I knew how to tell who was who, like, you know, what type of nigga was what type of nigga. So, um, I didn't really like the school food, I didn't eat the, the college food, I did in the beginning, like, the first week, I was like, oh, this is nice, and then at the second week, it was like, why are we still eating the same shit, so, I didn't really eat the school food like that, so after, like, the second, third week, I started just using my mother card to get food, or just ordering food, so, my god brother, he didn't care, he ate that shit, he liked it, he went to go get his dinner, all my other friends left out their room to go either get dinner or go to their dorm or go to the store or whatever they was about to do before they could, you know, go back in their room. <clears throat> he left, well, left, and then texted me like, um, yo, come to the bathroom. So me being a little, a little hot mamita, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. So I walked to the bathroom like right next to my room. So, you know, I woke up, I go to the bathroom, whatever, but he's not even in the bathroom. So, I'm thinking, I'm like, oh, this one of them college pranks, like, let me not, uh-uh. So, as I'm turning around to go out the bathroom, he walks in the bathroom. So, he's looking at me, I'm looking at him. We didn't even speak. Like, it was like a... So, the mind you, I'm not a bathroom type of girl. I know how to, I know how the gays get down. I'm not a bathroom type of girl. That's just not me. I'm not even a. I'm not even a, a first day type of. I'm not even a first link type of girl. So, it was like, Mister, I don't know what you used to. Where you from? I don't know how they get down back home. But I'm not that girl. Like that's not me. So, um, I left out, but like on the side. Like okay, the bathroom door is like right here, but it's two entrances to the bathroom. This is before I acted gay, told gay, remember that. This is when I, 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 I moved regular. Somebody walked in the bathroom. So I looked, and I gave him, like, the little, like... So I walked back out, so I go to my room. He intends to come in my room or whatever. So we didn't even do, like, the full, you know... When he came inside of my room, he closed the door, and then you know what, you know, the... And then, you know, like, the, the hands and all of that and stuff, like... It was getting there. So, when it was like getting there, my guard brother had like on the door. So, my guard brother, like, you know, like saved by the bell, I was saved by the knock. So, my guard brother come back in or whatever. So, he like, all right, later. So, he give me a dab. I dab him up. He leave. I leave. Well, I go back to like lay on my bed and he leave out. Now, my guard brother knew that I was, you know, because that's my guard brother. So, I told him years ago so my god brother already knew like he used to, like he laid there while i was on the phone with boys and stuff um so i told my god brother i'm like yo like he's uh my god brother like no way i'm like no like i'm telling you so my god brother like you lying so i text him on snap whatever we're texting but it's just to show my god brother that i'm like that i'm showing him that like you know he's really like that so we text him we text him we text him we speaking about it my god brother like nah wow so fast forward next day he texts me like Yo, I was like, yo, he was like, um, when, what time you finish your classes? I'm like, oh, I only got two classes today. I got, I had an 8 a.m. to like 10, and then I had something from like, uh, 11.30 to like 2, and then I was done. So he was like, oh, my last class had three, what time your guard brother class is over? So now I'm like, all right, I know what he's trying to get into, let me see. So I'm like, um, I talked to my guard brother, like, when your class is over? He said, I got classes all day, but I got a night class from 5 to 9. I'm like, oh. 
You know what I'm saying? That's that's lit. That's enough time to get it in, a nigga. I'm hype. So he comes or whatever. Like later on that day, he comes in the room. First, it was just like it was awkward because we knew what happened the day before, but we ain't act on it because somebody came in. So it was like it, it was awkward. So we just, just sitting there chilling and all that other stuff. Hold on, y'all. I put my phone on the charger. My other phone. Now, y'all, I wasn't doing anything at the time, like, cause I think I was when I was in college, I was only, I think I was only eighteen, cause I turned nineteen when I came out, then I turned twenty last year. Okay, yeah, so I was only eighteen. So I'm not really, I was experienced with females, but I wasn't experienced with men, with boys, guys, whatever you call them. I wasn't experienced with that. I didn't do nothing yet. So, you know, we um. We went to get into it, start, and you know, me thinking, you know, I'm the shorter one, I'm the smaller one, I'm the, you know, I was a little always more, you know, feminine, girly, whatever, because he, you wouldn't even know he was this way unless you, unless somebody told you. So I'm thinking, you know, like, uh, I gotta be the one that, y'all, this man, this man tall ass, bent up, <laughs> but I didn't know how to go about it at that time because I wasn't doing it at that time. So, boom, 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 bam, it happens. Um, not all, not everything, but, but I'm, you know, it happens. So I told my girl brother and I told my other friend. Just the two guys that was like my road dogs. It's like I texted him like, yo, we going to eat, we going to the cafe, we going to whatever, whatever, let's walk to McDonald's, whatever. Those was, those was my friends, my girl brother and my other friend. So I told them and they already, they knew but they didn't act on it because I said, like, don't say nothing, don't make it obvious. So they, they, didn't, they didn't make it, you know, no different. We all still hung out. What made it weird, he started to come around when my whole friend group came around. But it was because our friend group and his friend group started to merge. So it was like me and him knew what was going on, what was, what was the deal. But nobody else knew except my godmother and my friend. So, like, when, like, it, even the littlest of things, it would be funny. Like, even if they're like, all right, we're all, like, eating. And then, like, they'll be like, like, if I say I'll go get napkins, and he goes to the bathroom, even though we really went to get napkins and go to the bathroom, it looked like we went to go. <laughs> so my girl brother would write in the chat, like, y'all nasty. And I'll be like, bro, it's not, like, I'm dead. I, like, send a picture, like, I'm really getting napkins. You know what I'm saying? So, anyway, long story short, um, I did further down the line expose the guy because, let me tell y'all, when I did proceed to get jumped, he kind of like was there. He supposedly he recorded it, but my whole thing is, you could have stopped it. I'm mad little. Yeah, they did not. The men did not need to jump me. Two of them would have been fine. Two of y'all could have jumped me. I'd have took that. I'd have took that on a high because I would have had one of y'all while the other one beat me up. I would have beat the other one up. But it took like five, six of y'all for little old me. Anyway, so. When I did end up, you know, coming out or whatever, we still was, you know, like, like you know, like, speaking, because all of this was before. So when I did end up coming out, we still was speaking, we still was, we didn't never go the full way, but we still linked up. Or, like, I went to his room, he went to my room. For just, you know, like, little stuff. So, after the whole fight situation and the cops and getting kicked out of school and all of that other stuff, Somebody told me that he wrote in the little basketball chat something that I posted on Snap. So I'm like, okay, you want to be funny, so we're going to post something. So I remembered that one day, in the acts of him doing what he was doing, I recorded it. And, like, I know it wasn't right, but I posted it. So when I posted it, I put a sticker over it, and I put turn your volume up. It's not, no. I put... See, I put send this in y'all group chats volume up. So I covered everything, but you could hear it. So, um, and then I told my mom. So my mom came with me to move my stuff out the dorm or whatever. We're walking. And she's like, ain't that? And I'm like, yeah. But this one I was already, this one I was a little more out. So I had on a little, probably had on a little leather, a little tight leather, tight jeans or something. I don't know. Why don't we walking by? And she's like, ain't that? And I'm like, yeah, girl. Like, like, cause this was. This was after. This was out. This was when the bad bitch came out the out the caterpillar shop. You know what I'm saying? 
But that little like DL relationship or whatever you wanted to call it, it was going on for like September, uh, no, like, yeah, like September, October. And I think I got, I got kicked out of school like right before Thanksgiving. Like I got kicked out of school like probably like November 2nd or something. And then I had to go back. Then I had to go to court. So I like when they finally was like, you got to get out, you got to go. It was before, you know, before Thanksgiving. Um, That's really it. I just felt like it was a story time. I just wanted to, I don't know, I just wanted to share it. But... I feel like I said his name somewhere in this video. If I did, I don't care because anybody going to do nothing to me. But I don't think I did. I don't know. Um, Until next time, guys. Make sure, like I said, you like, follow, subscribe, comment, share. All that other good stuff because I need to get 20K. Like, ASAP. I'm trying to get 20K. I'm I'm just, I'm, you know what I'm saying? And it's like, can, like, can we let's go? Can we hurry it up? Can we we got to speed it up. We got we to gotta, we gotta speed it up. But, um, yeah, until next time, guys. You want some more than Salute the Van Jones.